Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. I'm up here. Well, I'll show you guys. I'm up here in the uh, attic of my job, which is a pretty big attic, if you can see all the way down there. That's just one segment of it. No, no, no. I'm hungover. Come on. Let me I do. Good morning, everyone. I wanted to... Um, I wanted to read this update that BZ posted last night and uh, remind everyone that, yeah, meditation is in about one hour. And in when I post this up on YouTube, I will go ahead and put in uh, Sophia Love's link for the meditation. I'm going to put in uh, Judy's uh, live stream. It's a Facebook live stream link. And I'm also going to put up uh, BZ's YouTube page because she is going to be uh, taking... Judy's uh, Facebook uh, videos, live streams, and putting them on her on BZ's uh, YouTube channel. So I'll have all three of those links when I post this back up on YouTube, guys. But I uh, just wanted to read this real quick. Um, we got about, what, 45 minutes or so until showtime starts. Hopefully that'll really kind of be around 11.30, as you'll hear. Uh, we're, you know, trying to get the uh, judge to grant a motion uh, to allow, you know, the cameras, court reporters uh, in, into the courtroom to, re to record the proceedings. So anyway, um, I'll just whiz through this. HATJ will have a jurisdiction hearing 10.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, Tuesday, August 29th, 2017. Randall Bean will have a hearing to represent himself uh, Tuesday at 2.30 p.m. Tuesday the 29th, today, both of them. Bill and Yosef will be in the courtroom uh, Judy Jandora will be doing a live Facebook stream. Her Facebook timeline is linked uh, on the i-uv.com um, BZ's blog on the website. Judy will be doing it in short segments. I will go into her account. This is BZ talking. I will go into her account and download each segment and upload to YouTube for all to see and share. For those who do not have Facebook, for, for those who do not have, have Facebook, uh, Gary H. will also be there with his Periscope account. And, uh, hey, Gary H., are, are you, if you happen to be watching, or does anybody know what Gary H. is? Um, hi, hi, guys. Does anybody know what Gary H.'s uh, Periscope name is? If you do, um, I, I, I don't know if she'll be able to record yet that in the courthouse because the they, they have motioned, uh, filed a motion. The judge has to rule on that motion, I think, first thing. So we should know that by 11 a.m., I think. So anybody that knows Gary H., please post Gary's Periscope. Yes, please do. We will also be there with his Periscope account. Sorry, M8, are they in court today? All right, if anybody sees that, I'm not reading the notes. If anybody sees that uh, Gary's Periscope name, please keep repeating that. There are many other people who are going to be there in person. That's awesome. Thank you for everybody who's traveled there. Really appreciate it. Uh, I cannot be there, unfortunately to be helping out with the live feed from outside of the courthouse. We have set things into motion to hire our own court reporters who will do audio, video, stenography, and transcription of both hearings. The judge must be petitioned by a motion that we have, uh, that we have had filed in the court. We've done all the steps needed. Now the ball is in Judge Shirley's court. The court reporter, the court reporter firm is on standby awaiting a positive ruling. Heather and her attorney consultant, this attorney consultant explained that the public defender's office is treated like a public law firm. Therefore, since Randy was already appointed a public defender, it presented an issue as since it is now one case. Anyone assisting Heather now must be from the criminal justice panel, which members are approved uh, by a joint effort of the public defender's office and judges of the Eastern District. He is on the panel. If he is kept on, uh, he, could, he could not be paid for his services as it would be unethical. He would simply uh, be her co-counsel. I don't really follow that, guys, but I wanted to read it to you anyway, so I can't give you an interpretation there because I don't quite understand it myself, and I've read it a couple times, but that's okay. I don't feel like it's that important for me to understand. Heather and her attorney consultant will address the motion to have our court reporter to record proceedings and ask for a ruling from Judge Shirley on that. If Judge Shirley grants the motion and the request for a 30-minute recess for the court reporters to set up, that is what will happen, and then the hearing will unfold in this flow. Uh, order, of, order of these different matters, 
that will unfold on Tuesday, challenge of jurisdiction, arraignment, choice of Francis or Sue Juris, you can go Google that, uh, detention hearing. Now is the time to let the truth of who you are shine. Center yourself, set your intention for an expansive, expansive outcome. Let's do it. I love you all. BZ. So there it is, guys. Um, I'm going to rock on and, and get this thing posted on YouTube. Please, pr please spread the word so we can have as many people uh, joining in the meditation at 1030, which, again, I'll have the link to that, uh, that Sophia Love put together. And, yeah, does anybody have Gary H.'s Periscope? I'm going to ask one last time. I, I didn't know if anybody had posted it. Uh, anybody? Okay, well, if somebody figures that out, please um, send it to me somehow. I don't know his last name. I'm sorry. So anyway, I'm going to roll because I want to get this posted up on YouTube and get all those links on there, and that will take me a second. Um, so anyway, big day, guys. Um, set your thoughts and intentions for big, big, big good outcomes today because it's going to happen, and I can't wait to watch it unfold, all right? All right, guys, I'll see you all.